and welcome back to my channel welcome if you're new make sure you hit that subscribe button and let's get right into this video so today we have a bunch of different stuff here we're going to be using some of the poly gels from the mccart purple poly gel kit which i have right here and basically we're just going to need some other nail decorations so i have already done a video using the purple poly gel kit but for those who haven't seen it i will swatch these colors for you you get four different poly gels in that kit and the last color that i don't have here is clear because here this is what the clear is looking like. She's looking sad and used up. <laughs> so you get three main purple poly gels. If you hear jingling in the background, that is my cat playing with a cat toy. The first one was this dark purple jelly. The next is this nice light purple. And then the last color is just a nice regular purple. Here are the colors. And let's just get right into this nail set. Do you know what I should do? Since Christmas time is coming up, I'm gonna light a Christmas candle. It smells so, so good. This one is hot cocoa and cream. This is one of my candles from last year. I need to go to Bath and Body Works and get some new Christmas candles because I'm so excited for Christmas time. I just need to buy some Christmas decorations for my room. I have been looking for Christmas decorations, but I've only really looked at Target and they don't really have like the decorations I want. Okay, so first things first, here are my natural nails. This is what they're looking like. I'm just gonna start off by pushing back the cuticles. Okay, so back to what I was saying. Target, the Christmas decorations that are at like Target, like they're not really what I want, you know? They're for like house decorations. I need like nice bedroom decorations. <laughs> and I tried looking on Amazon, but I just can't really find anything I like. I don't know, I need to look at other places. Okay, so next I'm going to be taking my cuticle scissors and I'm going to be trimming off this excess dead skin. So I'm not sure where I'm supposed to look for like to get nice, actually like nice and cute Christmas decorations for my room. But I just thought about it and I might do like peppermint theme for my room. That'd be pretty cute. I didn't really think of a theme. I was just thinking like Christmas decorations, but a theme is nice. A theme is a good thing to have. Peppermint is a good idea because I could definitely probably find some good stuff on Amazon. Okay, so I just have my fine grit sanding band right here and I'm just gonna remove the shine from the nails. And I'm also gonna take off any of this dead skin from around the cuticle area. I just try to keep my e-file on the lowest speed it can go, but sadly, like, this e-file doesn't really go, like, really slow. Like, the slowest it can go is this, and this is still pretty fast, especially for natural nails. Okay, so I'm just going to be using these not polished nail tips. These are extra, extra long nail tips. And I'm actually going to be doing something a little bit different today. I am going to be double tipping these nails. These nails are going to be, uh very long today. I'm kind of scared for myself. So I'll get back to you after I'm done sizing out all these nail tips. Okay, so I got all the nail tips sized out and I'm contemplating if I want to do this to myself. Let's just get started pulling these on. Um, Basically, I have a peel off base coat on these nails because I'm not going to keep them on that long. And I'm going to glue them on with some base coat because nail glue isn't strong enough to hold these nails on to this peel off base coat. Okay, so I got it glued on right here and I'm just going to cure this fully in my nail lamp. Okay, so I have the first set of nail tips on. I'm not going to keep a lot of this second nail tip on, but you know, just a little bit more. I'm just going to use some base coat to glue these on. These are long. These are long. Yes, they are. Um, That's going to be okay. We love long nails here. I'm going to cure this. Oh, here's how it looks. Okay, so here's what we got. Yes. <laughs> I'm gonna cut these down. Um, the thumb one is a little bit crooked, but it should be fine. Like I said before, I'm not gonna keep a lot of the second nail tip on. I haven't done extra extendo nails in so long. Okay, so I think this is good. They look pretty crazy right now. I need to reinforce these with some base coat down here because I just know they're not gonna hold up during the shaping. Next things next, I'm just going to reshape these nail tips because, you know, on the side here and then file over the top of them. Okay, so here's what I got for the nails after I reshaped the nail tips. They look so much better. I was a little bit nervous at first for how they were looking. I um, kind of ran out of my the napkins that I normally use. So I'm just using these regular napkins and they have like this really 
distracting pattern on them so i'm sorry about that the only thing that i'm like i just don't like is how you see the second tip is kind of like popped up there it's like not aligned perfectly with the other tip like that is annoying me so much i just didn't think about that when i was gluing it on i should have really pressed it down okay so now we're going to be adding on some base coat to these nails like on all the nail okay so here are the two colors i'm going to be using I'm basically going to be using the two opaque colors and I'm pretty sure that one of these bottles is not going to be enough for this whole hand. I think I'm going to do mismatch so I'm going to do one the dark purple, one the light purple and you know continue like that. Um, and I don't want to do like ombre or anything because I don't want to encapsulate. I just don't feel like encapsulating especially these long nails. Okay so I got my slip solution here and we're just gonna get started. I think I'm gonna do... I think I'm gonna start with the dark purple. Um, I have my sister here. Do you want to say hi with your cucumber snack? Yay! Oh my! What, what 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 is that? What you got there? Cheese. Listen to this crunch! Oh my, that crunch! I'm gonna do dark purple on the pointer finger. And because these nails are really long, I'm gonna do these in two beads. Even though that's gonna take longer, I'm just gonna do it that way. I think it'll save me a lot of frustration. Do you like the nail length? Mm-hmm. Yeah? Mm-hmm. If I could do nails, I'd get stilettos that long. Look at this purple! That's a nice purple. I want stilettos. I was gonna do stilettos, but I just did stilettos. Okay, so I'm just smoothing out this poly gel at the tip of the nail here. We got a cruncher in the back. You can crunch. Here is how the nail tip is looking so far. Gorgeous. Gorgeous? You think it's gorgeous? All right, so I'm just gonna cure this in my nail lamp. All right, so now that I got the tip of the nail all cured and done, I'm gonna put the rest of the poly gel on the nail. What? What? Bro. It's poly gel. So much. It's not, it's gonna be the right amount. Okay, so I'm just pushing the poly gel as close to the cuticle area as I can get it. You see this? You see this structure right here? Once I have it kind of like this, I just drag the poly gel to fit down the side here and then do the same thing on the other side. And then once I have, you know, the side cuticle area all situated, I just smooth out the rest of this poly gel. Oh my, what do you call that nail design? Simplistic? modesty simplistic modesty eh okay so here is the nail fully done in all its beautiful length beautiful beautiful it's very heavy like i said before like the nail didn't fully press down all the way so it's kind of like not leveled with the other nail tip it's annoying but you can't notice it from the front so it's okay so i'm just gonna cure this in the nail lamp okay and for the next nail i'm going to be making it the light purple so like i did before i'm just gonna be putting one long bead of this poly gel at the tip of the nail then i'm just gonna smooth this out So I have the first two nails done. Here's how they look. And I think I'll get back to you guys when I'm done applying all the poly gel. So far they look really, really good. And obviously I love this length. Okay, so yeah, I'll get back to you once I'm done with the poly gel. Okay, so I got all the poly gel on the nails. Here's how they are looking. Next step is to reshape them. So I just have my hand file and my McCart dust collector and I'm just going to get reshaping these nails. 
Okay, so I'm just gonna finish this video off with the voiceover because this is what happens. I'll start the video off by talking, but then I'll get really tired by the end and then I won't wanna talk anymore. And sometimes I just wish I finished, you know, talking in the video, but that's okay because sometimes like when I'm talking in the video, I don't really talk about everything that I wanna talk about. So on the voiceover, I can. I just really wanna talk about Christmas stuff because I'm very excited for Christmas. November is going by so fast. It's already, what, the middle of November now? Um, I'm almost done with school. I'm very excited for that too. I only have like three or four weeks left, I think, because I think I finished school on December 10th. Yeah, I get three weeks of Christmas break, which I'm very happy about. Do you know what I just got? This was a very bad purchase because now I'm like, that's the only thing I want to do. I got an Xbox and it's the greatest thing Ever. So now all I want to do is play video games. But that was my early Christmas present to myself and my younger sister. I want to get Christmas decorations for my room and I might do like a little like shop with me vlog that I want to add at the end of my videos or something. Just like for some fun Christmas shopping stuff. What I know I need is a Christmas blanket, a pillow, like a throw pillow, and just some other Christmas decorations. And also I just wanted to let you guys know that Macar is having a Black Friday sale going on right now. You can get up to 60% off different items and poly gel kits. This purple poly gel kit is on sale for 50% off and you can also use the code Nails by Vic for an additional 15% off. If you guys want to save some money or if you wanted to get some poly gel kits as like christmas gifts for your friends or family now is the time we'll be saving some big bucks right here definitely go check that sale out right now back to the nail set i love the decorations on these nails the nail tech that i got this nail design from on instagram i love all of her nail sets like she does really really long nails and i just love them all so much i mean that's like my jam right there this nail decoration design is kind of it reminds me of like whimsical it reminds me of fairies even though it's butterflies i think if i had some kind of fairy charm decoration i feel like that would fit in here really well there's just something about like the the clear um iridescent gems with the butterflies and the gold little beads it just looks so good all together So after I'm done adding all that nail decoration on, I'm just gonna be adding on some cuticle oil. And here are how the nails turned out. Let me know what you guys think of this nail set in the comments. I wanted to talk about so much other random stuff in this video, but I'll just probably talk about all the fun Christmas stuff in another video. Here are what the nails look like outside. They are stunning outside. I don't know, I just love them. But anyway, before I continue just rambling about these nails, if you guys are interested in this purple McCart poly gel kit, I highly recommend it. I used this kit a while ago in one of my other videos, and of course I loved it. Their poly gel is just so good. All the information for this kit will be in the description you can use the code nails by vic for 15 percent off your order and yeah i just highly recommend it let me know what you guys think of this extra extra long nail length of course i love them um i haven't done really long nails like this in so long so it's kind of like refreshing but anyway that is pretty much it for this video it was kind of short i wish it was longer um i hope you all enjoyed thank you thank you so much for watching make sure you like comment and subscribe and i will talk to you guys in another video probably gonna be posting another one this week so i will talk to you guys then bye